Brennan and get a puppy. we're going to pick our puppy up. So we're going to meet the guy now. Um, right now. Yes. Today we're driving. <laughs> yes, we're driving today. So it is, yes, I already said that, it's Friday. So um, we had to wait all week, but he's coming to meet us. Um, and so we're driving out, it's like a 45 minute drive. So we're gonna go pick her up, we're super excited. We still haven't decided on a name yet, but we're gonna get her and see how she is first and then pick a name. So. So I will let you guys see her when we get there. So we just got her home and got her some water. Hi, sweet girls. Hi, sweet girls. He's so sweet. So she peed all over herself and threw up in the van, in the crate. So we'll have to give her a bath, huh? What do you think? That's a sweet girls. We don't have a name yet. We gotta come up with one. But we're home. She's good. She's free to roam around. It's all fenced in. So we are happy, happy. Oh, never brought her toy out. <laughs> We're taking the puppy on a perimeter walk. And I'm not sure if Belle is the name anymore because Nova decided to change it. So. She's a lot more playful today. That's a good girl. We are on our way to pick up some new farm friends. Yay. We just got the puppy and I saw a lady post something on Facebook about these birds and um, also <laughs> last minute built a little pen to keep them in for a couple of days until they get used to our house. <laughs> and then um, we're going to pick them up now and bring them back to the house and then they're actually going to just free roam. And like, awesome. Um, but it is a tom, turkey, and two guineas, um, a male and a female. So we'll probably just try to collect the eggs and maybe get an incubator and just incubate the eggs and possibly have more guineas or sell them or whatever. So that's the plan. That's what we're doing today. Okay, so we picked up our birds. This is the turkey, the tom, and then these are the two guineas here. They're male and female. And she actually gave us some eggs too. Um, so we went and got an incubator and we're gonna try to um, incubate the eggs and see if we can get some more guineas. Um, but he is mad right now. <laughs> Look at all that red. He changes colors. His face turns red when he's mad. Um, and he is not happy right now from the drive. So, we're gonna get them into their new home. I'll show you guys what that looks like. And we're excited. What do you think, dude? Okay, we let the birds Oh yeah, I need to make a way for you to get out when you lock yourself in. Learn that one the hard way with the chicken. Maybe I'm trying to believe. Can you open this door? You locked me in, boys? 
Yeah. What? How am I supposed to get up? I didn't, I didn't, I didn't lock you, you in. Me? I need to do the string thing like I did, uh, <laughs> with chickens. You told me a video. <laughs> Alright, his stuff isn't red anymore, so... No, he's just happy not to be caged up. Yeah. I think it's pretty good for, like, you yeah. know, not being a horse runner anymore. Alright. We have a turkey and two guineas. I'm gonna watch you next time. And we have guinea eggs, so we're gonna incubate them. See what happens. Okay, so update. We put the um, turkey and the guineas in, and then Austin was over there grabbing some stuff for the chickens, and we saw an egg. Actually, there was two eggs, but one of them was like, had opened up, and it was like, the outside was like, I don't even know how to describe it, like mushy. But this one's good. So we're gonna put this one with the ones that the lady gave us. I think there's like four or five of them and we're gonna put them in the incubator that we got and see if we can't get some more. I'm so excited. Now we're waiting on our chicken. Good morning guys. So we're gonna be picking up our second LGD puppy today. Um, luckily I found somebody on a farm page that's coming from the Greenville area and they're coming down to Somerville. So. Um, because the puppy is at a farm in Rock Hill and I cannot drive six hours with Amy in the car. So, um, he's going to bring the puppy down. I'm going to go meet him and we're going to get our second puppy. And we're hoping that this helps with, um, Rosie's howling at night because she's like super lonely. Um, and it'll give her somebody to play with during the day. Maybe she won't be chewing on everything outside. So anyways, we're excited. We'll bring you along when we get in the car and head to town. Okay, we've got Bo home. It took me a minute to get back to getting a video because Annie was screaming the entire ride home. But Rosie is super happy. Nova named the new puppy Bo. And I think Rosie's gonna be bigger, but she also is mixed with Anatolian, whereas Bo is all Great Pyrenees. They are happy. We'll see how tonight goes. Okay, so Be free. <laughs> I think he still thinks he might be in the cage. Uh, Alright, Chelsea, get him to chase you so I can drop the camera. <laughs> like a horror film. Alright. 